finishing up yesterday's vlog. I haven't uh, really thought about if I am going to record today or not, but yeah. <laughs> Gonna be the first time working out uh, ever since I got the blood clot and the surgery. This can be exciting. See if I uh, still have some strength. But... A little bit of pain, but nothing too serious. So I think that I'm probably gonna get back pretty quick. Feels good. Feels like I'm uh, I'm in need of stretching. Gonna finish up with 15 minutes on the cross trainer. Let's get some cardio back. Oh, oh. it's terrible. Can definitely feel that I haven't been, been moving a lot lately. Whew. That's a Swedish town called Malmö. That is Denmark, and that is the bridge connecting the two. Today's been a very slow day, and uh, there's not been that much happening. I've been working for a couple of hours, and the gym was great though. I still feel good in the, uh, in the pec, but I decided to take a little bit of a drive now in the evening. Also, the sunset is probably gonna be pretty amazing today. Was a few wondering what uh, this app was called where you can see the golden hour and all that interesting stuff in your apple watch and i think that the app is called lumi if i'm not mistaken check that out oh good sunset <sighs> freezing my fingers off <sighs> it is incredibly cold in the wind and it's very windy outside right now this sunset reminded me a whole lot on the time when I quit my job because the first spring when I was running my business full-time I decided to shoot every single sunset and sunrise that I possibly could it was intense but it was fun because every one of them is unique so it didn't look the same that's kind of cool iPhone 13. I placed my order, I think it was like three days after it was released and it was postponed like weeks and weeks and weeks. And now I saw the store here in Gothenburg had it all in stock. So I decided to buy it. We've uh, already started to buy some Christmas gifts for the family and Alex. Alex's favorite right now is dinosaurs. Every single one of them, he just loves to play with them. Check this one out. It's a dinosaur. Turn into a dinosaur egg. That's genius. The only downside with IKEA though is that it is so big, so you never know where you are and where you're supposed to go. You just gotta wing it whenever you're here. <laughs> Self-checkout is definitely something that I like a lot about Sweden because we have it in almost every store. IKEA included. <laughs> it is approximately a three-hour drive from where Alexander's grandparents live back to Gothenburg. 
So it feels good to finally be back and be done with all the shopping and call it a day.